Welcome to this special edition of Frequency Matters, the Art from Microwave Update series. I'm Pat Hindle, and I'm here with Natasha Baker, founder and CEO of SNAP EDA. Welcome, Natasha. Thank you, Patrick. So SNAP EDA makes electronic design faster and easier by supplying symbols, footprints, and 3D models for electronic components. How did you come up with this idea to aggregate these building blocks and build a business from it? Yeah, well, um, I'm an electrical engineer by background, uh, and I started my career uh, designing circuit boards. Um, and one day I was tasked with designing a circuit board for a trade show. The company I was working for made PCB design tools. Um, and so we thought it would be a really cool idea to create a, um, a, you know, a demo where people could play Mario Kart at the trade show booth. Um, and we figured we can replace the controller uh, with a raw circuit board that um, allows engineers to, you know, to, to play Mario Kart, you know, with the raw circuit board. So I figured, oh, like this is going to be a super easy circuit board to create. It's just an accelerometer. Um, I can work from a reference design. I can get this done in a few hours and, you know, we'll turn around a cool, a cool demo for the trade show. So uh, I chose a really popular Texas Instruments accelerometer, um, started designing the circuit board. Uh, but what, what I quickly noticed was that all of the different kind of components that I needed uh, for that reference design uh, weren't available in my CAD tool. So what happened is I ended up spending far, far longer designing this circuit board um, because I had to make all the components from scratch. Um, so the schematic symbols, the PCB footprints, and so on. Um, and so it was really in that moment that I realized engineers need uh, Google for electronics a place they can go to to download all the different content that they need to design electronics faster, um, letting them you know, drag and drop it into their designs so that they can focus on what they're best at, which is designing in you know, new products, bringing their ideas to life. Um, and what I kind of realized was for engineers to go through all of this tedious work, it's kind of like a tax on innovation. Um, so that was the genesis and that's how it all got started. So you've lived through the pain and you're solving that problem. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So you now have uh, more than 10 million parts in your library. Uh, how exactly does an engineer go about finding and using the building blocks and what are the costs to use them? Yeah, so they can just come to our website um, or you know any of the various integrations that we have. We have um, integrations into PCB tools with distributors and so on but they just search for a component that they're looking for, just like they would search for it on Google or any other you know, search engine. They can put in USB type C or you know, 60 pin header. Um, you know, they can get really granular and put in like things like the pitch um, or they can put in the exact part number, you know, like any 555. Uh, and then you know, they'll find parts that they're looking for. We have additional filters. They can filter for things like mounting type or supplier. Um, and then when they found the component that they want to integrate into their design, they can just download it for the format that they want. We support over 15 different PCB design formats. We have a new product actually that lets people click one button and instantly import it into their PCB design tool like Altium directly from the web. Um, so there's, there's a few different ways, but um, think of it just like a, a search engine where people can put in keywords, find what they're looking for and, and quickly download it. So you have like the buy now button on Amazon for quick uh, relief. Yes. Um, so we're still, we're still trying to think of the right name for it. Um, <laughs> right now it's auto import. So if they click that button, um, it pairs with uh, a new app we just launched last year called the Snap EDA desktop launch, uh, desktop app, sorry. Um, and what it does is it automatically opens up their PCB design tool like Altium and instantly lets them add it to their library or place it. So that's, that's our buy now button or auto import button. So you mentioned you have partnerships with the software companies and some of the distributors. Can you tell us what some of those are? Like, I know you announced the DigiKey partnership and also, you know, what kind of CAD model people do you work with on that end? Yeah, so um, in addition to finding CAD models on the Snap EDA platform, engineers can also access CAD models through what we call our syndication network. Um, and what that is, it's a collection of different companies like distributors, PCD design tools, um, media sites who want to provide CAD models to their customers. Um, and what we do is we work with them to, yeah, to provide CAD models to help their engineers design faster too. Um, so the motivation for that was to 
meet engineers where they are. Um, and it's the recognition that, you know, if an engineer is purchasing components on DigiKey, which so many engineers do, uh, we want to augment that experience with a CAD model that, that will help them get to scale faster. Um, so we have today over 30 different partners in our network. Um, and last year alone, uh, we made it a top objective. And uh, for our team, we added 12 new syndication partners. Um, so companies like, you know, or tools like Autodesk Fusion, um, we integrated with RS Components Design Spark, um, Seed Studio, and many other uh, partners. And, uh, and really, it's just to help engineers find uh, Snap EDA CAD models all over the web and within their tools. So how about on the supplier side, you announced that you have a new analytics service for component suppliers called Snap Insights. Can you tell us how that works? What are the benefits and costs to suppliers who take advantage of this service? Yeah, so Snap Insights is to Snap EDA what Google Analytics is to Google. Um, so if you think about uh, Snap EDA being a two-sided marketplace, we have the engineers, we have the suppliers. So Snap Insights allows suppliers to understand how their components are being used by engineers uh, in the market. Um, so what this allows them to see is things like what components are engineers downloading the most, what keywords are people using to find their components? Um, and this allows component suppliers to optimize how their components are being discovered and therefore designed in. Um, so this tool is actually completely free for suppliers. Um, they can you know, create an account at insights.snapeda.com, uh, um, completely free, and they can instantly get access to uh, a whole array of analytics about their products. Wow, you've really become the guru of electronics. That's great. <laughs> so I know your business is growing fast. Uh, what are some additional plans or, for new products or services do you have for this year? Yeah, so, um, you know, today we are driving um, over a million design ins each year for component suppliers um, in nearly every country of the world. Uh, and over um, hundreds of thousands of designs are made with Snap EDA each year. Um, looking at our December metrics, we grew 91% over the previous year. Um, so we're continuing to grow, uh, you know, traction with engineers and we're continuing to expand and have more engineers kind of signing up and using us more and more, which is really nice to see um, that we're able to add more value to them. Um, and over the next year, we're going to kind of continue focusing on our mission, which is helping engineers uh, design electronics faster by removing barriers. Um, and really that entails two things. So number one is continuing to focus on the fundamental things that we know engineers want and that we're going to have to continue, you know, working on for, you know, the near future, which is engineers always want, you know, more components, more flexibility with the components, expanding to new formats in the market. You know, we added um, Zookin in December. Um, we added Design Spark last year. So expanding to new PCB design tools is always a focus. Uh, but additionally, as we look ahead to the year, um, uh, to 2020, um, a big focus of ours is also going to be expanding beyond content. So uh, we've spent a lot of time building up this massive database of components for engineers and understanding how engineers are using those components. Um, so as we look at the year ahead, um, we'll be launching some new features that expand uh, our product beyond just content um, to help engineers you know, make better decisions. So I'll leave it at that. <laughs> Excellent. Well, thank you very much for talking with me today about Snap EDA. Very impressive. I've been following your news announcements and I'm really impressed with the way you're servicing your customers. Your company's doing very well, so we hope to follow up with you in the near future and maybe get an update. We thank everybody for watching today and join us next time on Frequency Matters.